Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. In Jesus' mighty name. Always with a huge smile, a large smile on my face when I have to bring the word of God to you. It brings fulfillment to my heart knowing that there is somebody there who is listening to the voice of the Lord and taking large decisions based on the prophetic words that God releases up through me. If you happen to be seeing me for the first time, my name is Samuel E. Molombe, and I am the man that God is actively using. <laughs> I bring you a fresh word today in Jesus' mighty name. On this platform, we bring you the word of God. I pray with you and I mean just um, bringing you the supernatural right at your doorstep, right at your home. You want to be a part of it. If you are not yet subscribed, please kindly consider subscribing now um, to be a part of our community. Ring the notification bell so that you will be updated when we post. Hallelujah. Those of you who are um, members and partners, you believe in me, you are reaching out to me one way or the other, I want to thank you so much. Now, this is not just um, a tradition that I say this. I really am grateful. And the fact that I say it on every video is just to prove to you how grateful I am for God using you. God bless you in Jesus' name. So the Lord says, this person is madly in love with you and wants to marry you, wants to settle down with you. That's a very important prophetic word for a specific person. You need this as a confirmation because you are praying to God not to make the same mistakes you have made in previous times or just to confirm to either to wait or to, you know, continue your pursuit. The Lord says, yes, this person is madly in love with you and wants to marry you. Now, you're going to listen to the details of this prophecy to know if you are the one I'm talking to. And while I give the prophetic word, I want you to check your heart and check your spirit and hear the specifics so that you know you are the one I am talking to. Would you mind um, receiving some prayers for me before we go into the word? Father, thank you for today and thank you for your word in my mouth. I receive utterance. I receive the spirit of utterance. I speak, oh Lord, that may I not speak my own words and my own thoughts, but only what you have deposited in my spirit for this specific person. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Hallelujah. Wow. So family, the Lord is saying that there is somebody who is madly in love with you and his intention is to marry you. Marriage is very important. But who you marry is more important. Can I say that again? Marriage in itself is very important. But more than marriage is who you marry. You see, you, if you marry a good spouse, you have a prayer partner. If you marry a wrong spouse, you have a prayer point. <laughs> if you marry a good spouse, your heaven begins on the earth. If you marry a bad spouse, your hell begins on the earth. Who you marry can determine how you spend eternity because yeah they will affect you and cause you to have bitterness and maybe the trumpet of god sounds or jesus comes for you and your heart is not ready you know because of bitterness anger just because of who you are so i know as much as you do that this is a very important subject is an is an is a subject you have to take with prayers you have to take with caution that's why god is bringing this prophetic word so there is a specific person you have had two field relationships now please i want you to listen to the specifics again we are not just here putting out content we are speaking to specific people and if i had your details i would send the prophetic word to you directly and not say it up on the channel and so the reason why we say this on the channel is because god doesn't give us your specific um, look um, address or anything that we can just send a word to you so but there is somebody you have had to feel relationships and you are scared in your heart to make another move. Yes, you know, you feel in your spirit that God has shown you who your kingdom spouse has to be, but you need a confirmation. And the person is making advances towards you. You are, you are in talking terms or probably you are even more serious than just talking terms, but you are still trusting for you know, um, a, a confirmation in your heart. Well, the Lord got me out of the place where I was just resting, having a good time. And he says, go tell my daughter, go tell my son that yes, this person loves you and their intention is to settle down with you. So this is the will of God for you. God is saying that you should, you know, pursue. God is saying that you should pursue. But make sure you are the one with two field relationships. Make sure you are the one that, you know, is believing God. You are talking with somebody right now. I'm not talking about you knowing someone. And then the person doesn't know because um, it has to be a mutual thing. The Lord that spoke to you should speak to the person 
And then if all of these factors are right, it means I'm talking to you. God says you are in the right setup. But every one of you that are watching this right now up until this point, I want to make a very serious prayer for you. You will not make a mistake in marriage. In the name of Jesus, you will not make a mistake in marriage. I declare and I declare in the name of the Lord that God will help you in that aspect. You are going to meet the kingdom spouse and it will happen quickly. It will happen quickly. You are tired of being single. You are tired of being alone. The Lord will sort you out this same year in Jesus' name. I declare the blessing of God upon you. And I declare that God will do as he has said over your life in Jesus' name. Do you receive this word with gladness? Let me know in the comment section if you are the one I was talking to so that I can continue to pray with you. Please take it serious and put a comment in there. I will read it and pray with you. The Lord bless you. I love you. And shalom.